it's Jana and welcome to Pinch of Luck. Today we will be making an Olaf cake. I am so excited to make this cake. It's for my son's birthday. He chose this cake. My son saw this cake on a fellow YouTuber's channel, Cakes by Chapa, so go check him out. So I'm just really excited to make this. It's gonna be super cute. Today we will need a mixer, a mixing bowl, a spatula, cake mix, two-thirds water, one-fourth oil, and two eggs. I have two eight-inch rounds, some cooking spray. For decorating, we need white fondant, icing, blue coloring, brown coloring, a knife. I have food writer pens, Kit Kats, Starburst. I have a 12-inch round tray, a skewer, icing spatula, and the cake leveler. So let's get lucky! All right, so let's take our cake mix. I actually have hot cocoa cake mix, which is so perfect because he's a snowman and all we ever want is hot chocolate during the winter. But you can use any kind of cake that you would like. This is of course seasonal, so if you can't find it, just use whatever flavor. Haha, <laughs> that's cute. There's little marshmallows in there. He so we have our water, oil, and two eggs. Let's mix it up. All right, we got that all mixed up, so let's spray down our pans. All right, got our pans all greased up, so let's throw our batter in. So I'm just gonna split it in half and just dump it. All right, that looks great. We're gonna throw these in at 350 for about 20, 23 minutes. And when the toothpick comes out clean, we'll be good to go. And then I'll let these cool. While they're in the oven, we can make our fondant Olaf. He's gonna be so cute, I'm so excited. We got our cakes in the oven, so let's start trying to make Olaf here. I've never made a little character before, so bear with me. So I have my fondant. We do not need all of this. I already softened it up in the microwave a little bit, according to the directions. So we're just gonna work our fondant a little bit. Get it nice and pliable with the warmth of our nice clean hands. So we are gonna need a little bit to color brown later for his arms and his hair. So we'll just set that aside. We need a, a good size round ball for his bottom part. We just set all the pieces on there for now. A little bit of a smaller ball for his top part of his body. This is the easy part. Now we need his head. So we'll roll a little ball and then we're gonna actually make it into a pear shape. Okay, so we have our two round balls. We have the ball for his head, so we gotta make that into a little pear shape. So just elongate it a little bit. All right, that looks cute. Okay, so you're gonna cut in a little mouth so we can open it up. Little smile there. Take your skewer and open it up a little bit. Now he needs his little teeth. He's gonna make a little rectangle. All right, so our little head is just coming along here. We gotta make little circles for his eyes. Now we're gonna use Starburst for his nose, so we have to just get the orange one ha, right on top. We're just gonna cut a little piece of that off and we'll just mold that into his little nose. Let's make a little hole for this thing to stick in. All right, so now we're gonna take our pens. So we will be needing the black and the blue for his eyelids. Make a little pupils. Color in his mouth. Never used these pens before, I don't know. Where does teeth go? There they are. I'm just gonna wet that a little bit, see if that'll help it stick. It's starting to look like Olaf. So we have a little blue eyelid and his eyebrows. Reshape a little bit here. He's not looking as smiley as he was. Maybe it'll be easier once he's on the skewer. All right, so we're gonna put all his little pieces. Whoa, calm down there, Olaf. So there's a little Olaf. Now we just need to 
Make a little bit of brown for his hair and his arms. Before we make the arms and hair, let's go ahead and make his little buddy that's in the spa with him. So we just need a little circle. A couple of eyeballs. Cut open a little mouth. He needs a little nose. Color in his pupils and his mouth. Whoa. All right, he's got his little buddy. That was a lot easier than Olaf. We have our little bit of brown here. I have some food gloves because coloring fondant can get a little mushy. And you're just gonna fold it in. Squisha, squisha, squisha. Squisha, squisha, squisha. I guess this is why people always buy the already colored ones, right? We're getting there. All right, so we're just gonna roll this baby out into a skinny little snake. Remember making these in school? So these two little guys should be good for the arms. So we're gonna take these and we're gonna slice the ends into three pieces. Branch them out a little bit, get it? Those look like arms to me. So now we wanna put them in there. We're gonna make a hole where they go. I'm gonna use the Starburst package to hold where they go. We're gonna cut this into three pieces, just at the end. All right, so we have Olaf and his friend all done. I'm gonna let it hit and dry out a little bit, so hopefully his arms and his hair will stay. Like I said, I've never done this before, so hey, I may be doing it the hard way, I may be doing it the wrong way, but hey, I did it, right? Yeah. Now that our cakes are cooling, let's go ahead and make the icing. We are going to make it light blue for the water in the little jacuzzi. So let's throw some in here. Well, that looks like about three cups worth. All right, let's get our blue and throw some in and see how it looks. All right, let's mix it. All right, well that looks like a beautiful blue for our spa, I love it. So we will set that aside and go get our cakes. So I am back, we have our cakes, they look wonderful. So let's just pop these babies out. Woohoo! bonk, bonk. All right, let's get these trimmed up here. Let's see how, how low shall we go? These are sliced and diced, so let's get our 12 inch round so we can put these babies on there. All right, we're gonna take our nice blue here and just put a little bit in the middle. Now let's place our top on there. Now we don't have to do this one upside down because this cake is so awesome. You can be as sloppy as you want because the top is gonna be the spa. So it doesn't have to be smooth or nothing. And we're just gonna put icing all the way around and then we'll start putting our Kit Kats on. You do want a pretty good thick layer here so that it can hold on to the Kit Kats really well. Easy as that. So let's get our Kit Kats and we'll start stick them on, on there. All right, I have the full size bars here. So let's open it up. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> I love Kit Kats. So you will notice one side says Kit Kat and one side says nothing. So we want the nothing side on the outside. So we just squish it in there. It's just that easy. Package number two. Last pack. We ended up using 10 packs of regular Kit Kats for my eight inch cake. Just to let you know how many you would actually need with one to spare. Break me off a pizza that you can't find. Kit Kats are the best. <laughs> that was tasty. Can't be a spa without water, so let's throw it all in there. We're just gonna glob it in. It doesn't really matter, because it's water. Awesome. All right, I'm gonna swooshy swooshy it around a little bit, just to make it look a little bit more like water. Oh my gosh, that looks fantastic already. I can't wait to put Olaf in there. Woohoo. All right, so here comes Olaf. Squishy, 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 squ
pushing down into the cake a little bit. Oh yeah, he's chilling in the spa. Oops, got a little water on him. And here's his little buddy. Uh huh. All right, guys. Well, that looks awesome. I'm pretty impressed with my first little fondant character. Not too bad. I've seen worse Olafs out there, and you know you have too. It looks like we got lucky. Well guys, this was super fun to make. It was actually super easy too, other than making your own little person. If you make this, let me know. Send me a pic and I'll throw it on my website. That'll be super awesome. And then let me know what you guys wanna see. I'm always looking for new fun ideas. And as always, if you loved it, like it, subscribe to it, and share it. Thanks guys. Mwah.